All right, let's date some more fucking helicopters. Unless we're here, and there's a person. You fool! It was not my fault. Please, give me another chance. I will manage this myself. I have no idea who this person is. Helicopter, excuse me. <gasps> Dad? That's right. I came here to ensure my name is not dragged through the mud any further. Wow, he is angry, maybe? I don't care who you are. You will not take Apache with you. Oh, this will be fun. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, man, he's scary, Rock. Oh, fuck, he got me, dude. He's very good. We're gonna do Rock again. Oh, no. Okay. One more chance. Oh. Like I said, we lose immediately. You think Game of Chase is the worst way to decide the fate of any helicopter? Purists will jump on your face and say dating games require strategy and lightning reflexes. We believe that as well. And your skills were not enough to save Apache. She's taken out of the school forever. The ambience of the hangar is really tense. Isn't she the one I bought the present for? That's really shitty. I have chosen poorly. Everyone saw how Apache was drawn out of school and how your failed her. No one is blaming you besides yourself. You can't help wondering what Apache's doing right now. You go to sleep hoping tomorrow will be a better day for everyone. Man, well that's a downer note to start this on, but sure. As soon as the day starts, you're summoned by Mangusta Sensei to Heliport 49. Or was it 69? No, it was definitely 49. That'd be a shoddy joke even for this game. After a short flight, you arrive at Helicopter 49. Huh, there's no one here. Maybe it was Heliport 69. <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be that sort of game. Guess we'll be making a uh, <clears throat> vertical descent into helicopter 69. Once I land, I see everybody's already formed up. Finally! What took you so long? I overestimated the maturity of the developer. A classic mistake. Classic rookie mistake. Wow, me and this guy are basically the same person. Never let your guard down. Even if the joke appears to have lost all comedic purpose. Do you really think they would insist on using an immature joke like that again? It seems you haven't been around dating sims as long as I have. Quite literally, I am this man and he is me. And by dating sims, I mean WAR GAMES! Not another anthropomorphized military dating game. No need to clarify that, Senpai. Senpai, I can speak. I think we all know what we bought, but okay. Now that you're here, let me be the first and only to congratulate you on remaining alive until now. You'll have a couple of days off so you can visit your families. Or lie down in the dirt and die for all I care. But at least I have the common courtesy to not do it while I'm on duty. Just remember you have a final test, so study hard. Or don't, I get paid either way. That is all dismissed. Great. This is probably the last chance I'll have to socialize with my classmates for the final exam. I need to find a partner to study with. It'd also be a good opportunity to spend some extra time with one of my classmates and maybe even learn a little bit about them. Right. We need to choose carefully. Also, hmm? Huh. <laughs> 69. Fucking devs, dude. You scan the heliport with your sensors while deciding which attack helicopter you will talk to. Who will we ask to be our study partner? Don't study alone. That's retarded. Okay. Which one is the cute childhood friend with the foot fetish? I'm pretty sure it's Kiowa. We're gonna go with Kiowa. Ki is it Kiowa? Viper's the cute, the, the, like, shy one. We're gonna go with Kiowa. I trust in my heart. I was wondering if you already had a partner to study with for the exam. I was planning on going home and studying there. You can come if you don't mind having my mom around. Way to kill the mood. Uh, you're kidding? She makes the best food ever, and your hangar is really cool. Ha! Huh, except for that time she wanted to get rid of all the heteronormative rooms in the house. What? She was flying around going, we're helicopters. We need a repair hangar, not a garage. We're not tank gendered. I didn't know there were tank gendered people. Have an open mind, fuck biscuit. It's 2018, what did you expect? I reminded her that it would just stir up more trouble with the HOA. Everything's back to normal now. You know, I'm glad to hear that, I guess. Well, see you on my house. You remember the address, right? Sure, of course, see you there. You head back to the hangar and right to bed. But first you spend some time laying there reviewing flight manuals before falling asleep. Ninth day at the academy, good shit. You wake up and head directly to Kiowa's place. Your bag is stuffed tighter than a marine in an M M M MRAP. I don't know. 
With the flight and maneuver manuals, it feels really heavy. You don't remember ever being given so much information during the school year. You were at Kiowa's place. It's nice. <laughs> it's still in a hangar, I suppose. You let yourself in like when you were kids. Kiowa, I'm here. Kiowa speaks to you from upstairs. I guess there's an upstairs. Okay, you can start unpacking the materials. I'll be right down. You start unpacking yourself, but soon you need to go change your oil. I refuse to describe this. Good on you, boss. You already know what it means. This is a family-friendly game. Uh, okay. Oh my god, when you get out, Kiwa's already organized the rest of your stuff and started to take some notes of her own. Oh, Kiwa, you don't need to do all this by yourself. I was going to organize this as soon as I got out of the bathroom. Oh, don't worry about it. I came down and started to sort my stuff out while waiting for you. Oh, you never change. You used to do the same thing when we were kids when I came to study. Well, you never were very organized, so I always helped you out. Oh, that was a direct hit. Critical as always. You both start to laugh. It's been a long time since we're both together like this. Checking around while studying and teasing each other. Fuck, Miss Kitchen, is that you? Oh no, Kiwa S. Mother. You see a familiar silhouette on the other side of the doorway. Yes, Miss Kiwa, how are you? Oh, good, good. Long time no see you, dear. Let me prepare both of you something to eat. Oh, no need, Miss Kiwa. I already ate, but thanks a lot. Oh, nonsense. I'll be right there with some mini pizzas in no time. Mom, we're okay. There's, like, no need to worry. Uh, but, uh, oh, I see. Silly me. What? I just realized how much you two have grown up. And, of course, you don't want some old machine around you when you want to be alone and close. Mom, shut up! Oh, don't worry. I need to do some stuff. Wink! And I hit the save button. Astounding. Don't say wink. It's not supposed to work like that. Just go. Of course, don't worry. Good luck. Have fun. Use protection. No, I mean, ugh. I hit auto, too. Wow, I'm just hitting all those buttons. You laugh at the situation. Eventually, Kiwa calms down. You continue to study together and joke around like always. You finish studying with Kiwa and get back to the base's hangar. Wait, nothing happens? There's a shadow of a helicopter in here. You lay down your bed and finally fall asleep. Well, that was anticlimactic. But this is our 10th day at the academy, and everyone knows important things happen on the 10th day. Finally, the day of the final exam is here. You get up and head right to the heliport. You see other choppers walking by, most of them really nervous. And as a result, you start getting really nervous, too. You're not really sure if you study enough, but that'll have to do it. You get to the heliport. Amazingly, everything seems to indicate you're in the right place. Astounding! There's a first time for everything, I guess. Mangusta-sensei is already here. The exam will start now! I hope you all studied accordingly. I will take a nap while you finish this. Uh, can't we just cheat? But don't worry, there's a military satellite watching over you all. And it's standing ready to shoot you all to hell if someone cheating is detected. Okay, asked and answered. You mean ready to shoot the person that's cheating, right? Oh no, the laser on the satellite has a minimum effective radius of 100 meters. That's why we'll be taking a nap way the fuck over here. Mangus Sensei points to a military bunker really far away. Good luck, and try not to make any sudden movements or breathe too heavily. It should be easy since you're helicopters. What? Mangusta Sensei flies away. You start to work on the exam. You make your way through most of the questions without major difficulty. Seems like all the study is paying off. You leave some of the other more difficult questions blank and guess on a few others. Probably, maybe, everything will be fine. Look at that, a D plus. Good enough. That's called passing, my dudes. At least you pass this year. You go back to the hangar and just fall asleep. This happens a lot. After these days, you were definitely exhausted, so this is exactly what you need. Our 11th day. I thought 10 would be the last one. Augustus Sense has ordered you to go to the heliport, so you head there as soon as possible. Since you arrived, you noticed almost all your teammates are there. You made a lot of friends in just a couple days. You are the last one to arrive, fuck biscuit. So we better start. What, um, so, dude? The enemies finally started their counteroffensive, so I need each of you to find a partner and go on mission immediately. Remember, your partner will have your back on each mission, so it's better if you choose someone you get along with. So who's it gonna be? Uh, who the fuck is this? I don't even remember this girl. I'm ready for whatever mission is ahead of us. Your finning points with sure, this girl are plus four. What? Did they just go up for? Were we at zero? What's happening? You don't have enough Vinny points for Sharuski to choose as a partner. Great! Because I don't remember her. Thanks again for convincing Augusta Sensei to let me stay. This is the moment I've been waiting for to prove to everyone my real value. 
Hey, plus five on the Osprey. Good stuff. That's not enough to choose it as a partner. Great. Two up and two down. I've seen the enemy artillery, and I am not impressed. I guess I can let you hide behind me if you get, like, scared or whatever. Our points are minus one. Probably not high enough. Look at that. It's not. Someone... Yay! We're at, like, nine with her. This will work. Oh, don't worry, fuck biscuit. I can provide all the support you need. Sorry, I meant we. They're only plus four! I worked so hard! Is that not high enough? Are we gonna lose? We don't have enough affinity points! What happened to all of my affinity points? I worked so hard, I thought I had, like, nine! Sorry, fuck biscuit, but I prefer partnering with my sister. We don't have enough affinity points with her either. Fuck biscuit, you're really annoying. Don't even think about choosing me. Look at that, we don't have enough points for her either. Well, those are all the people we have left for you to pick. So who's it gonna be? Oh, Viper! My angel! Wait, don't start without me! Sorry, my alarm didn't wake me up. Did I miss something? Yeah, plus eight! Viper! Thank God you're here, you've saved me! You have enough affinity points to choose her as our partner! We don't just lose yet! Okay, now as I was partner! Viper! Thank you! I choose Viper! She's my hero! Wait, what's happening? Did it crash? I don't know what happened. I choose the Viper! Yay! Fuck, Biscuit! You've always been nice to me even when you didn't know me! This is so romantic. It would be an honor to be your partner. Is this me? I couldn't think of anyone kinder than you. Are you ready to go on an adventure with me? Let's go, Fuck Biscuit. Yay! Look at that, we won! Despite my best efforts to sabotage us. So yeah, cool. Thank you guys for joining me on this little adventure. Uh, if you like that, like and subscribe, and leave a comment letting me know if I should go back and do all the other helicopters. I probably will anyway, so fuck you in your comments, but let me know which one I should start on then. I'll catch you guys next time.